Lauren and Mike, we're actually live in one of the neighborhoods above the command post. And as you can see behind me, the flames are just growing in size. 3,000 acres have burned so far this morning. And hundreds of families, well, they are preparing for the worst today. Several agencies coming together to battle these flames. Hundreds of acres have already been burned by the way fire, and hundreds of homes in the area are still threatened by it this morning. Firefighters say the flames could burn for days, and neighbors like Susan Martin have been packing up their entire houses. We've just packed up clothing and food and um, personal items. Um, we're just going to go down to the campground if we need to. Other neighbors like Sean are ready to go, but he's using most of his time to drive up and down the hills, helping those in need as they prepare for evacuations. You should always have a bug out plan because you never know with the times the way they are nowadays, with things that are going on in the world, you should always be prepared to bug out. Hundreds of Kern County firefighters are teaming up with the U.S. Forest Service and Bureau of Land Management to fight the way fire. Controlling it around the Kernville and Wofford Heights area as best as we can. We have. Uh, strike teams of engines, dozers, hand crews, and we're doing our best to keep it out of the structures and drive it more into the wildland type areas. And Kern County firefighters say still no word on what has caused this massive fire. Again, 3,000 acres have burned so far. The fire is growing in size as we speak. So we'll be bringing you updates all throughout the mornings. Definitely stay tuned to 23ABC. Back to you guys.